people here too still nervous because it is still hurricane yep. season and we do have a new wave that we're tracking okay. and it will put some of you on alert because it's heading towards the Caribbean. So it put us here on the weather team on alert, but we don't want you to worry or panic because it does not look like a direct threat to us. But take a look at your screen. We have two tropical waves that we are tracking out there. And that first one that we are watching is the one heading towards the Caribbean. It has a low chance of development within the next five days. Only a 10% chance within the next two days and then a 20% chance within the next five days. But over the past day or so, it has started to uh, get its act together a little bit better. Those areas, those showers and thunderstorms there, they're starting to develop a little bit more. You can see that wave there. That's going to head off to the west and eventually move into the Caribbean. Now, what I will say is models right now they take it more towards Central America and not towards us in the Gulf. Of course, a lot could change, so that's why we're going to watch it very closely. But for now, you don't have anything to worry about. We will keep you updated, though. In the meantime, there's also another tropical wave in the eastern Atlantic. It has a high chance of development within the next five days. If it does become a tropical storm, it will be named Julia. It's likely it could become a tropical depression, though, later on into the middle of the upcoming work week. So for us, no tropical threats directly to us right now. In fact, it's just some nice weather, a really nice morning out there. 51 degrees in Bogalusa, 56 Galliano. Meanwhile, already warming into the 60s, places like the airport, the lakefront, and over towards Gulfport, Beerus coming in at 74 degrees. A little bit of a breeze out there. There's a light breeze, and that will stick around today in spots. Places like the lakefront or coastal areas, you'll feel that breeze more out of the north, anywhere from 5 to 15 miles an hour. Other than that, it is sunny and warm, a little bit warmer than yesterday. Highs today moving into the middle 80s. So if you're heading to the Fried Chicken Festival today, notice that you You'll be warming up into the 80s. Closer to the lakefront, you'll likely stay in the lower 80s. Still, though, don't forget your sunscreen. And if you head closer to the lake, you'll notice that breeze, which will help keep you a little bit more comfortable. Meanwhile, the St. Tammany Parish Fair, you'll likely warm up towards 85 degrees later on in the afternoon under lots of sunshine. So a little bit warm out there. Then tonight, mostly clear, cool to somewhat chilly for some of you down into the 50s overnight. Likely not seeing a lot of signs that show the 40s like we saw this morning. I won't rule it out, but a lot of you likely staying in the 50s into the 60s. Then tomorrow will be very similar to today. Highs right back into the middle 80s. Now this is normal for this time of year. Our, our average high temperature right around 85 degrees. So this is very typical for October, for an early October week, and that's going to stick around over the next several days. Now, something else I'm watching though too, looks like a cold front will try to move in next weekend. I think it's going to be a dry passage and it will likely drop our temperatures by a few degrees again next Saturday. Sounds good to me. Lee, thank you.